Hello there, this is Di Farrelly. Your mother has told me that you might be kind enough to listen to a few of my songs and give this frustrated songwriter some direction. These songs are recorded in the back bedroom. I am not a musician, neither am I a singer. The first song I wrote about 33 years ago, I think I wrote it in May. I was looking out of the kitchen window one morning and the bank in fact was full of bluebells and the boys indeed were making hair. My husband and I have been living deep in the country for over 10 years now and friends of mine that come to the town often ask what on earth do you do with yourself all the time? Well, I tell them this is just what we do do. Now, I'm a right old-fashioned Burke and I love waltzes. Probably that's my problem, you can tell me. I find these extremely easy to write. I suppose everybody does, to know. Please really listen to a waltz. Now, this next song I wrote specially for children, but I think it probably is for grown up children as well. and ad-libbing and so on. I'm going to play, I hope I'm not mistaken, a very strong ballad. I do wish I had a sort of voice that could build it out. It needs building. sending you my song, which I sent to my two young managers in May. They said it was a winner. Now when I ask them about the record, they say I, I should have sent it to them earlier, perhaps in July. I don't know whether you think the 
that song is worth completing? I think I perhaps don't. If you've listened thus far, I am extremely grateful, because I know how precious your time is. I got the inspiration for this next song, Walking Through the Churchyard. There was a new headstone, and written on it was, Love's last gift is remembrance. I'd never heard that saying before, and it stayed in my mind for quite a while. Um, after this, I'm going to, if you're still interested, but the reason I've put it on after my little is because I can't get it right. It's about, really, it's a very pictorial poem, I think, about family life, and that's why I keep trying and trying, because I think it needs a lot of harmony and background to it. Uh, of course, I cannot put that over myself. If you'd like to listen to it, please do. Finally, and... Uh, I'll finish up with a little folk song about whether to go on or whether not to go on or what to do, etc. Your words about my songs really encourage me. Although I have, I think, pretty nearly given up songwriting, I just can't frustration. Bye-bye now. Thank you very much for listening.